There's a new high-tech mug that's giving a new jolt to your Java, and our Jane Wells gave it a try. This is an Ember Smart Mug, an $80 coffee cup with a battery attached to an app where you set the temperature for your coffee and it holds the temperature for over an hour. No more cold coffee. Investors include Joe Jonas. <laughs> Hot coffee is a big deal. I'm Clay Alexander. I'm the founder and CEO of Ember. Clay Alexander is a lifelong inventor whose office has an old Alexander Graham Bell telephone <laughs> and an original Thomas Edison phonograph. Here's how he created Ember. It was 2009. I was sitting there in my kitchen having scrambled eggs with my wife and I had just sold my light bulb to GE. The reason that's relevant is that I had come off of about two to three years of thermal science engineering. And so when my eggs got cold, I thought, okay, I gotta fix this. Like, this is the 21st century. Like, at a bare minimum, my plate should be able to keep my food at a decent eating temperature. Alexander worked on the technology for years before turning his focus to coffee mugs, launching in Starbucks at the end of 2016. I like the long game, and I feel like that's also really important, is to be patient. If I were to say annual revenues top 10 million, would I be wrong? No, you are not wrong. Am I way off? We're doing really well. The company is valued at $140 million and projects profitability by the end of this year with plans for an IPO or to be acquired. Its cups and travel mugs are sold not just in Starbucks, but now in Apple stores. And what's next? We plan to go from here into self-heated dinner plates, and we have a baby bottle that we're launching, which will uh, uh, heat the milk or formula right up to body temperature within five minutes. Ember is going to do some groundbreaking stuff. I can't speak about everything, but what they've been working on in their technology, it's, it's unbelievable. An investment the Jonas Brothers hope is their latest hot hit. So I poured uh, coffee in this on a chilly morning out here over a half hour ago. And it is still piping hot.